Hi, this is George, and in today's video, I'm going to do an experiment. I'm going to uh, talk and walk as if we were going on a walk together, and specifically going on a walk with Buddy, who is such a good boy. I'm telling him to wait until he's ready to, I'm ready to release him. Um, so <laughs> instead of showing my face, which uh, is uh, not necessarily anything to look at, <laughs> nature is much more beautiful, um, I'm just going to share with you my content for by going on a walk today. Oh, uh, okay, he, he got impatient. All right, so what I want to talk about today is to clarify your money and business heroes. What I mean is that if you, I mean, you, you probably have in your mind some models that you want to emulate and that you want to avoid when it comes to doing business. Now, those models are probably not uh, the people, you know, other businesses are probably not conscious to you. Like maybe you see their marketing and you're like, oh, I don't want to do that kind of marketing. Or you look at rich people who um, don't seem to be adding a lot of value in the world. Maybe they created a, a company that you know sells things that are not beneficial for the world. And you're like, well, I don't want to, I don't want to become rich. Or look at, you know, the media uh, loves to. Um, uh, and you know sometimes rightly so, but loves to loves to rip on rich people because they oftentimes came out of uh, already uh, fortunate circumstances or whatnot. So, so uh, clarify your money heroes, and I'll I'll tell you about some of mine, and you can kind of see what I mean, and I want you to clarify your own too. So, uh, one money hero uh, is Leo Babauta. He is the creator of the website ZenHabits.net. You can check it out. And what's amazing about him is that he has been blogging consistently for just a couple of, I think, um, I mean, when he started earning a full-time income, he had only been blogging for, I think, something like two or three years. So uh, he blogs on uh, habits, habit creation, living a more mindful life. And he makes a full-time living from selling his programs, membership sites, etc., uh, to support a family of six living in the San Francisco Bay Area. Now that's a lot of money, okay? Um, much more than most places in the world. Uh, so, so anyway, he um, and the reason why I, I admire him so much is because he is so generous. He is so generous um, with his content. He doesn't make anybody opt in, sign up for an email address in order to get his content, and um, you know, and he seems to have a really good work-life balance as well. Um, and so I love the, this combination of true generosity and true caring is what I feel from him and uh, the fact that he actually uh, has a work-life balance and, and is able to, to really support a family very successfully there. Um, the other uh, money model I have is Derek Sivers, who has amazing content. I highly recommend you go to his website, Sivers, S-I-V-E-R-S dot -E org. Uh, and he has wonderful notes about the books, the best books he's read in terms of self-help books. And this guy is also comes from an, an incredible place of service and generosity and care. And he created a company that was so successful that he then sold the company. But before he sold the company, he uh, created a legal agreement where basically most of that money uh, all of all of that money, actually, that, that from his company sales would go to go to charity after his death, and dur during his life, the, the the those savings from selling the company basically pay just enough for him to live, not not an extravagant life, but you know enough where he doesn't have to worry about money. And so I just so admire that kind of um, sense of I'm here to serve. I'm not just. And he still works very hard creating wonderful content for everyone. So I, I recommend you check these two people out. Um, look at your own money heroes and see if um, you can come up with ones that you really admire and say, yeah, you can make a lot of money and, and, uh, or make enough money and, and still serve the world. So with that, signing off. And uh, let me know what you think of this video format. Take care.